Hi guys, it's Heather, the Butterfly Effect Plant-Based Extreme Weight Loss, and it's a weigh-in Wednesday, except, oops, it's Thursday, and even more exciting, it's St. Patrick's Day. I got my little shamrock scarf, because I'm Irish-American, and now nobody can pinch me, but I'm kind of pinching myself, and I'll tell you guys why. So, um, I started out my weight loss journey at uh, 436 pounds, I'm five foot two. So very, very heavy, very um, sick, a lot of health problems. I had sleep apnea, I had um, arthritis, that was making it very difficult for me to walk. I had migraines, I had acne, I couldn't sleep. But the main thing I had, more overarching than anything else, is I had constant pain. Um, I had pain especially in my knees and in my feet and in my back and I was unable to stand for more than about five minutes at a time without being in horrible horrible pain um, and even though I had a big smile on my face I just felt trapped in my own body and um, felt really stuck I had a lot of like female problems um, with my hormones being all screwed up, which I also think was responsible for my acne and my eczema. And um, I took th a total of three blood pressure medicines. I took a medicine to help lower my genetically high cholesterol. And I was pre-diabetic and basically I was a mess. Okay, so that's where I started out. And then... Um, I went on a raw food diet in about 2004. Um, oh, excuse me, excuse me, ugh, I meant to say 2010. And I took off some weight and I was able to take off about 80 pounds over the course of about four years because I, um, I would do really well on it, but I would go up and down and um, I would really have trouble struggling with um, food addiction and I didn't quite have the handle on that that I do now. Um, I feel like a lot of food addiction is biochemical and I understand that now um, and it really makes a huge difference. So last year, um, 2015, I really got serious. Um, it was January 1st, it was a New Year's resolution. I had taken off the 80 pounds but I hadn't gotten any further and so I decided I was really gonna get serious. And um, to be even more serious about it, I started this channel in March um, of 2015 because I really wanted that accountability. I thought, good, bad, or ugly, I'm gonna report how I do every single week and um, maybe I'll inspire somebody who's like me who has so much weight to take off because I had a total of 300 pounds to take off and I had never met anybody um, who had that much weight to take off. So um, I got really serious about it and now I have taken off over 200 pounds, okay? And I really like to celebrate milestones. So I celebrated big time when I took off 100 pounds I celebrated when I took off 200 pounds and now I'm at another really big milestone for me and that is that I'm almost under 200 pounds, like as what I weigh. So last week, um, I was really close. I was at 206 pounds and I'm really, um, can, when I get to 199, that's gonna be a, a huge um, motivator for me. And so this week I'm really close. I'm at 202 pounds, okay? I have this deal with my body and that is that I do the right things. I do the right habits. I feed it the right food and then it takes off the weight as it wants to, okay? I am not um, attached to the outcome. And so even though it can be frustrating for me sometimes, um, that is the deal that I have with my body that I am responsible for the behaviors and it is responsible for the outcome. And I really encourage you to do the same thing. So the things you can control are what you eat, 
how you stay motivated. Do you watch inspiring YouTubers? Do you read books that help support you in your plan? Do you stay focused? Do you have friends or a Facebook group that you check in with? All these kinds of things are things that you can control. Do you go for a walk? And then um, you can't control how much like weight you take off. Your body will decide how much it's ready to release. So anyway, maybe it'll happen next week. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what my body wants to do. But I'm really excited that I took off four pounds this week, adding it to the pile. Um, almost, so I've taken off 234 pounds. 234 pounds it has come off of this body on my way to taking off 300 pounds total. So I'm super grateful that you guys have all been on my journey. And like I said, a huge factor in my success is that I have you guys to be, to help hold me accountable. And now I want to tell you about something just super cool. Went to my mailbox yesterday. I'm going to grab something. Hold on a sec. And look at this pinkalicious, adorable bag. Even the bag that I got in my mailbox. And what I got, this beautiful card. Look at this. Look how pretty this is, you guys. Look at that. Do you see the lady? And it immediately reminded me of the person who sent it to me, which is Chicky. Now, if you don't know Chicky, you are missing out. Chicky has a YouTube, and Chicky is an incredible lady. She is funny. She is hilarious. She's super smart. But mostly, Chicky is just like the embodiment of pure love. And I just love her channel. And um, she's an amazing person. She has some health challenges. She's taking those on. I know she's going to overcome. Chicky, if you are listening, I know that you are going to overcome, my friend. I believe in you. Anyway, Chicky sent me a present, and I just wanted to say how much I just I love this woman to pieces. But look at what I got. Look at what I got. Hail Mary macaroons, gluten-free and vegan. She knows how I roll. Live, thrive, vegan, right, Chicky? Anyway, I got these Hail Mary um, chocolate chip cookie dough macaroons. These are raw food. Chicky is in the raw is a raw chicky, and I'm so proud of her. She's doing so awesome. <coughs> and I also got chocolate 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 macaroons because even even a raw foodie girl sometimes needs a little chocolate, right? So. Uh, this was just incredibly kind and then I was really excited about this I got these chlorella tablets these are great you got to get your greens by any means so here's my St. Patrick's Day greens I'm really super excited about this I love um, chlorella especially and um, it's so funny I'm allergic to spirulina and um, so anyway these are what I this is what I do, and she had no way of knowing that. She just used her innate awesome chickiness to get me exactly what I love. Anyway, she is just a loving, kind, amazing person. I, I can't even believe this. Chicky, you are blowing me away. I did not even see this beautiful necklace in here. Look at that. Do you see that? How beautiful is that? And I love this. I will treasure this, Chicky, because it reminds me of you because you have such a big heart. You are an amazing person, and I just really, really appreciate this. And um, it almost made me cry when I got it in the mail because it just kind of came out of nowhere, a big old burst of love um, right at me. And so thank you. Thank you, Chicky. I hope you see this. Um, and I hope you, may you live a thousand years, is the Irish say. And um, yeah, I, I just, I love you. And I love all you guys. I hope you have a really great week. And um, maybe next week I'll be able to do my Wonderland contest. When I get to Wonderland, I am going to have a 
pretty good giveaway. I'm really excited about it. I've been thinking about it for a long time. So you can get presents too because I have to tell you, it feels really great. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll talk to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.